Hi guys, I'm Abroad here with another news update on men's health. And in this issue, we want to talk about ED, erectile dysfunction, and diabetes. So let's see what we have today. So there are two studies that I want to talk about. And problems with maintaining an erection may foretell heart trouble ahead for men with type 2 diabetes. So they're linking ED, type 2 diabetes, and the potential for heart trouble. There are two studies for that, and they appeared in the American College of Cardiology, which is a journal. And what they really summarized is that ED often precedes and predicts heart problems. So in the first study, it was Italian researchers. They found that among 291 men with type 2 diabetes, so these guys had type 2 diabetes, those who also had ED had twice the risk of suffering a heart attack, stroke, or other cardiovascular complications over the next four years. Now, generally speaking, 50 to 60 percent of men who have diabetes also have ED. So we're seeing that when you combine these issues, there is a risk, an increased risk of cardiovascular problems. The second study was done by Hong Kong researchers and they found that among diabetic men with no indications of heart disease at the beginning of the study, those with ED were 58 percent more likely to die of heart disease or have a heart attack or other non-fatal cardiac event. So these guys had no no heart problems, nothing that showed up. Yet if they had ED and they had diabetes, they had almost a 60% chance of having some type of cardiovascular event or dying of a heart attack. So really high numbers. Now, why is this? So ED is an early manifestation of the blood vessel damage caused by diabetes. Diabetes, high blood sugar levels, damage the lining of blood vessels. The lining of blood vessels are called the endothelium, and the endothelium produces something called nitric oxide, which has a boatload of positive effects on your body from maintaining your blood pressure, maintaining your cholesterol levels, maintaining proper blood flow so that erections work correctly. You want to look at ED as the check engine light on your car. When that thing goes on, you want to take your car into the shop. When you start having ED symptoms, whether you've been seeing your doctors for diabetes or other issues, you need to go in and talk about it because not only do you want to be treated for the ED, but you want to understand that it has a possibility of causing or as a warning sign of cardiovascular events and you want to do something about that. Now, one of the best ways to do something about it, to work with ED, to work with repairing the lining of your blood vessels is something called nitric oxide therapy. If you'd like to see a really good video on nitric oxide therapy, just follow the link in the description below this video and it'll take you there. It's, it's about five or eight minutes long, a little too long for this video, but really interesting. Now, if you have any questions about that video, this video, or any of the videos on my channel, give me a call or text me at 609-410-4790. I want to thank you for stopping by today and watching this video. Have a great day. And here's to your good health.